Exam 70-461 Bootcamp Querying Microsoft SQL Server 2012 This is Kalmantov. This is my new book. It is available on Amazon.com or in your local bookstore. Let's consider export from SQL Server 2012 to Excel. Right click on database, tasks, export data. Now the difference between import data and export data is uh, presetting the source or the destination so it's saving some setup time but otherwise it's the same program. We see now that uh, the source is pre-filled, it's Windows authentication and this is the database where we started with the right click. However, the wizard doesn't know the destination so it's just guessing so we have to specify the destination. These are the available versions. And uh, we are going to use the F drive, temp folder, and uh, the purchase order information. in XLS format. SQL Server 2007 requires XLSX format. So there would be an extra X at the end. Next copy data from one or more tables. We are going to copy data from two tables. From purchasing, purchase order header and purchase order detail. So these are going to be the sheets, the worksheets and the destination is going to be this file. Edit mappings It looks good. Edit mappings. It looks good. We, we can make changes if we need to. These data types are Excel data types, not T-SQL data types. We can make changes by editing uh, the create table statement as well. Not a table is created here. This is an Excel worksheet which is going created it just for terminology is used is similar to database. There are some other options like drop and recreate destination table but this is brand new so it's not appropriate for us. Okay we can preview it. Looks good. We can preview detail as well. It looks good. Next. We can run it immediately. We can also save it to SQL Server or we can save it to a file system. This is a drop down for security. Or we can only save it and not run it. But we are going to run it. Next. Finish, finish. So we see the transfers from the header table 4012 and 8845 from purchase order detail. If we click on it, we get uh, some more information. 
same for report this is the report close so let's check out the, the export so this is how it looks resize this column so we can see the figures so what we see is the purchase order detail table export it to excel and 8846 this is a purchase order header table export it to excel Four thousand thirteen rows. This is the end of a short demo.